All right, hello everyone. This is Gary here with Cinema.com, and I'm here to review the Xbox Connect 2 custom uh, adapters for the PC that are commonly available on eBay. As you know, the uh, Microsoft recently discontinued uh, the official adapter uh, connecting the Xbox Connect 2 camera to a PC, and now the uh, prices have surged to uh, as high as $400. I have seen them for an adapter that should be. Uh, $40. And this right here is the original Kinect camera uh, for the first Xbox. I got it for a few dollars a while back. And you know, you can use this for motion capture animation as well. However, I wanted the Xbox 2 camera because uh, it is just way better. So, you know, I desperately wanted to upgrade this thing to the Kinect 2, but just, I, you know, it's a hard pill to swallow spending, you know, three to $400 on a wire. Not the camera, the wire, the adapter, was costing like five times as much as the Kinect 2 camera. Luckily, some people are very good with electronics and started making their own custom adapters and modifying uh, Kinect 2 adapters. Uh, if you go on eBay, you can find services where you send them your Kinect 2 and then they will modify it so it can plug directly into a PC. They'll send it back and those usually run you $50. Or if you do not have an Xbox 2 Connect camera already, you can buy one that's pre-modified so it will fit onto a PC, thereby you don't need to buy the uh, adapter on eBay for a couple hundred dollars. You know, you see something that's custom modified and that, that just scares you. You have this image of this uh, old guy in his uh, rusty old shack or garage uh, with electrical equipment doing all these little surgical uh, experiments on used Connect 2 cameras and used parts he finds. So I was like, hmm, it's an off-putting image and you know, that's a lot of people were, were afraid of, but I found a lot of the vendors had 100% feedback and a lot of customer satisfaction. So decided to give it a try. Let's unbox it and uh, do a quick review. Now let's unbox the Connect 2 custom adapter. It comes in this nice little eBay box here and very nice packaging, even though it's a custom mod. Open it up. All right, let's get rid of the little air pockets there. All right, got our USB connector cable there. All right, instructions. All right, we've got this box. We'll open that up later. Very unexciting, but plugs. We'll see what these do and how these hook up later. And of course, we got the Connect 2. Ugh. All right, we got the plastic wrap off. Gonna throw this away. And there we go. Very, uh, yeah, they provided us with a very, very pristine condition Xbox 2 Connect. And it's, this looks brand new, really. And what I love about this, uh, as opposed to the first Xbox Connect, for the old Xbox, this comes with a tripod adapter. Very handy when you're doing motion capture. And now we get to see what's inside this little white box here. Aren't we? Yay. It's a power supply unit. And again, very pristine, very brand, everything looks brand new here. Okay, and right now I laid out everything that is included in the box on the table. You get your obvious uh, Xbox 2 Connect camera right here. You get your power supply brick. You get a plug. Yay, it's a plug. You have your main cable right here with the uh, little bent adapter that looks kind of weird. That is to plug into your Xbox One, uh, which I do not have because I am all about the business. And of course you have your custom made USB to connect cable. This replaces the expensive adapter. All right then, so now that everything is unboxed and uh, laid out here, let's do the fun part where we hook it up and see how well it works. Now we can make our uh, blockbuster video game animations or animated short. Here we have the Connect 2. This is what it looks like when it's hooked up to a tripod. And I am loving the tripod threads on the bottom of the Connect 2. That is a lifesaver because, uh, yeah, I was tired of putting the Connect 1 on a table. 
And here we have the rear of the Connect 2 with the two cables, that is the power cord on the bottom. And right here on the top, this is where the custom USB to PC cable goes. And right now I have the six foot cable, which is very short. I wish I had gotten the longer cable. I recommend getting a 10 or 15 foot cable. Okay, so now that we unboxed the Connect 2 camera, let's plug it into some motion capture animation to test it and see how it, well it works. I am using iPiSoft uh, software. All right, and as you can see here, a, the software recognizes the camera right away. I did not have to install any drivers. Uh, as soon as I booted up the system, it says Connect 2, ready to go, press record. All right, and as you can see right here, the Connect 2 is working very well and capturing the animations, and I'm looking like a jackass doing all these little weird motions against the wall. And for comparison's sake, I decided to do a little quick comparing with the old Xbox One Connect camera. And you will notice, unlike the second Xbox Connect, the much better Connect 2, there is no tripod mount on the bottom of this thing, so this is a royal pain in the butt to uh, use for motion capture animation. Uh, you know, it's obviously meant to sit on the top of the TV. Yeah, I'm gonna have to look like an idiot and duct tape it to the tripod. Which is very unprofessional. You don't wanna do this. Uh, but yeah, I'm just doing this for comparison's sake. <laughs> And as you can see, this is one reason why you want to upgrade to the Connect 2. Yep. And then the, the tilt head is nowhere near as smooth as the Connect 2 camera is. So, yeah. Uh, as you can see in the clips, uh, the field of view is much narrower. The resolution is terrible by comparison if you just look at the uh, video clip in the background. Or I, uh, again, I'm looking like an idiot doing all these weird motions. So the motions are competent with the old Xbox Connect 1. Uh, but, you know, they're not as good as a Connect 2. Uh, you see it gets confused a little bit more often. You have to do a little bit more tweaking in the motion capture animation software to get this perfect. So what's great about these custom mods is true motion capture animation studios, you really need to have multiple cameras uh, when you're doing mo uh, motion capture because when your limbs go behind your head or get lost and the camera can't see them, they get easily confused. That's one of the reasons I wanted to upgrade from the old Xbox camera because the old Xbox camera got very easily confused uh, when you did 360s and that's a very hard thing to capture. Uh, the Connect 2 has much better sensitivity, much, be much better resolution. All right, and so now it's great. Now everyone can afford uh, Connect 2 cameras in multiples uh, so that way they can have a decent studio for motion capture animation and the Connect 2 just looks beautiful when you have it in multiples uh, to capture every angle. I, I've seen so many videos where uh, you know, people are dancing and doing all these sorts of backspins and 360 degree motions that they connect one camera with, struggled with and it just looks completely fluid when you have multiple Connect 2s set up. And now everyone can afford them now that these services on eBay exist because otherwise it would cost several thousand dollars to have multiple Connect 2s and at which point you might as well just buy a motion capture suit. All right, and once again, the seller I got this unit from is called Connect Services. Technically, on their auction page, they state that the equipment is used, but again, as you've seen in the video, everything looked brand new to me, and everything was packaged professionally in vacuum-sealed bags and very clean, nice boxes. They also offer conversion services if you already have a Connect 2 camera but don't want to buy a new one. You just send them your unit, and then they'll ship it back to you uh, with the cable. Uh, custom built to go into your PC. Anyway, thanks for watching. Let me know what you guys think and if you've gotten this unit uh, Let me know how you like animating with it